Hermes Hermits. Because 154 is padding his way through. Oh, Johnny from Frost. I saw him laying on the ground earlier on here. Oh, there's three of them here. One that's trying to overtake 160. David Keyboard, he's, he's 159 or 156. Ian Nichols, 156. Jason Carr, 156. That's Jason Carbolt. Jason Carbolt. He would have won the last round but for a flat tyre. And he lost two minutes in time on the last lap. That was the past last lap. 164. Bo Anderson. Bo Anderson. Central Wales. I love to see these clubs from, from all across the country supporting our good old Eastern Centre. 163. Carl Davis. He was the musician, married to Jane, Jane, Jane Bolt. That's not like, that looks like Brian May. It is 167, couldn't make his stop. So that's the first, the clubman, super veteran. Andy Mason could well be following these two in conjunction stuff. It is Andy Mason, 166, Andy Mason. He's won the title, I think, this, for four years now since it was first introduced. And he's got a special birthday in December with a note on the end. I won't say what they're in front of it, but the Super Vets are 50 plus. Work it out. Now, are the Super Vets coming through? We've had two. This one doesn't seem very fast, but it's Gary Drage. In the, in the class overall, but he can't win. But he won a round. Hawkerton. The hybrid one, as I call it. 162. Chris Reed. Hello. Little Chubb remembers those four I've just mentioned. Oh dear. Who we got now? 171. Tim Ford. He partners uh, Tim Ford and Slower Stoft. He partners Jeff Sharp in the two man and they finished third overall in the expert class this year. One seventy. Timothy Newman. Language Timothy. One six nine, Trevor Scott. Now Trevor is the one who's got a new bike. I said, and he's really been wound up and going well. One seven five, Stephen Taylor, Whitley again. One seven six, Ben Pringle, Sitka. Does see reach on the back there? No. One seven two. Stephen Scope, so he's, he's a local centre rider. I've seen that, I'm sure. I could be wrong, yeah. Triangle. Good name for a television programme. I'm not sure how long it's going to go. The battery's running down. 180, it looks like Nigel Ross. It is Nigel Ross. 177. Richard Squirrel, of course. 182, he's going well. Keith Reedman, yeah, he's trying to Keith Reedman. Giesbrough, or Geisbrough, depends how you want to pronounce it. The Yorkshire people will tell you, or, or are they in Cleveland now? Now this is going to go soon, we're right down the low back to 173. Stephen Manning, 184. Jez Moss, Jez Moss. Jeremy here, being known as Jez, been let through there. He is um, in contention in, in the club and super vet class to get into the first, to get third. And not even get second if Graham May fluffs up. But Andy Mason is guaranteed second place anyway. 
and only Graham Mays can overtake him. So 16 points difference, but you never know. One eight one. Nick Harry. I did see one rider down here. Who is he? Look for one seven four. If he is one seven eight. Richard Keeble. One seven four. Steve Finch. Now is he riding? He's a good rider. One eight three. Keith Potter. Works for PNA Wood. 187, over the page, over the Cesare, Graham Cesare, spin name on his back, 186, Jason Peel, Lincolnshire, Indira, good old Lincolnshire, <coughs> my mother was born in Lincoln, 1908, and it was in December, and it was the 19th, God bless her. Bloody good cook, sorry, good cook, I should say. Was she just, whoa. 188, over the page. Over the page, over the page, over the page. Six five special, goes down the line. Sorry. <coughs> sorry, I'm going back to my youth. 185, Jeff Sharp, and <coughs> Jeff Sharp. Jeff Nelford, 189, over the page. Well, I think I'm going to conclude this, change the battery. Change position. 36 that was. Second test is underway. The championship class has already gone through. Lovely on that bend there, isn't it? I'm not shouting out the numbers, but I'm shouting out the numbers, but not the name. Put it together yourself. 47. Looking there, 51. Michael Rich has turned up. That's a club and veteran, that is. But he's sort of queuing up for their test. So are these clubs are coming through here now? 45, he's going quite well, isn't he? I think these are experts. No, ex yeah, of course they're experts. Expert veterans are coming along. Photographers there. Other top class photographers are available. Looks like Phil Rope has turned up. Andy Walters on the quad. Start the course. Back, meanwhile, back at the right. Makes a lot of noise, doesn't he? Just experimenting, probably zoom out a bit. So this is Michael Ridge. They're at 52, that's Gavin Hockey. 51, Michael Ridge. He's done by his brother. The senior Ridge. Here we got now, here we go, he's coming down, around the bend. 49. Trying to keep this straight. Okay. Number six 
Lucy. This could be spun. All spurgeon. Look at him flying there. He's determined to take third place in the expert searching class. He can't go any higher. Phil Roper. on the way it could be Paul Belton. I think it was could be his he's, he's styling out there. I think it is number which I believe is 59. Next one come out will be Mark Chapman. Pass winner of the expert section class. Number 64 is next one, he's been edged on here by this gentleman who just comes onto the camera. Go back again, shall we? Cut out. Mark Green, Mark Green, come on. Why he's riding, let's follow Mark. He didn't shout out, did he? What's my name, Mark? Just seen Nathan Greenaway walking, so he's not riding today. That means George Eustace, you have got third overall. George, you have got third overall in the expert class. In that case, you have made history because you're the first rider who has won the expert class. And, well, I do say with the public class third. Expert class third in successive years. You have made history. You're the only rider to do that. It's not going so well, this bit of filming, is it? Come along, great. We've moved on to the end of the special test. So I think this is the Third special test. And these are the experts coming out. And next that round for the championship class, there's three special tests back to back. Oh, oh he stopped there in time. I don't know why he's done it because you see where the checkered flag is. I can't see you. the beam is there. I think I'll probably see it. That's for pick him up. Like over there, there's the beam I the side where Will Harvey is. As soon as he goes through there, and that's Michael Rich, who looks like he's on to win the expert fashion class again. He's, he's in fourth place. Gavin Hockey's in the third place. But if he finishes like that, Michael Rich has got it. There's only uh, two points in it there, but they are more than they are five. They are five points different. So gap will close the gap. But we've got the last, the last lap to do. Thirty-seven. Somebody's going to go through the uh, barrier there. Fifty-two. And number 40. This is interesting to watch them to see who's going to crash. I saw one or two people crashing earlier on, but I was not filming at the time. I thought some some colleagues, some of my era. Get the camera straight. Being flashed there. Here it comes, got him. Number 43, that was. 
Fourth version off there, so expert veterans are going. 57 is Phil Roper. He's going very shortly. Can I get him? Just to there. We'll let him off very shortly. Here he goes. There goes Phil Roper. Can he climb above his fourth place? Can he make sure he's secure fourth place if he doesn't get service? Well, well, well. Anthony Rich there, you know, David Bellamy in the Polish. Now, what I can see from the championship class, Luke Parker is leading after two tests, and Jason Moore is down to 12. So, keep that up and finish. Luke would be the champion. Expert class. James Barker's in third spot after two tests. Jack Berry is, I think, about his further down. So that holds up. James Barker would win. Clubman veteran class. Sorry, I did cover that. It was like Michael Richards on the way of winning it. Expert veteran class, that is. Clubman class has already been won. The question of who's going to be second and third. Clubman veteran class, I'm just looking at that. And I'm the contenders, and I don't think Jeff Turner is a contender for third, for second place. Um, Steve Young's not riding. They just turned the top one, and Jason Carr bolts it further down. But whether he, he's not close enough, but to uh, take the championship, perhaps Steve Young will win it. He's not been here. Club and Super Veteran, well, Andy Mason, the leader, is well down on the special test. Um, Brian Mason's higher than he is. But Andy just needs 13th place, three points, to secure the title. But Graham needs to win. And he's about fourth, I think, amongst them. So, so that's my assessment at the moment for the situation. And Michael Ridge has just finished. And I'm sure today he's going to be expert veteran. I think I'm going to Gavin Hockey. He went off before. Michael Reed. And this is coming through. 56. How much going to do that? All Reverend Guts. Where, where are the 